here at Kahila Creek, which is uh, 75, 75 degrees today, and uh, perfect track, perfect conditions to test out the Ryan Dungey Factory Edition KTM. It's a little bit different in spec. Obviously, you can purchase this bike. It's a little bit different to the production bike, especially in America, because in America, they have the 4CS front forks, and obviously, we have air, but on this model, there's the air fork. Also, as well, the, the triple clamps come, and you've also got the factory seat, and the decals, also um, ECU mapping, which is slightly different, and, and a Kropovich pipe system. You also have a, a nice five-speed gearbox. So yeah, the spec of the bike's quite a little bit different. Is there a noticeable difference? Yes, because of the rear shock as well. It's got a different setting, which is modified to a higher spec than, than the production model, I personally feel. They've got to put water on the track. You know what I mean? It's like, like we've got enough water on, on the tracks in England. Just leave it. <laughs> Yeah, so, so that says it all really. It's a brilliant place. I've been here before, I come here in 2005. Yeah, it's, it's changed slightly, but it's just well prepped, obviously, um, to, the, to the highest spec. The, obviously, also as well, we've rode today the TLD, Red Bull Factory Edition. That's the same as well regarding front forks. It's nothing new to us, obviously, in the UK, but it is to obviously the American market. These bikes are a global edition as well. It's not going to be a different spec from the US or to European. Um, and the 250 today, that has a different pipe system, which is the FMF. Uh, there was a notable difference there as well. Our, also as well, the gearing is different on that bike. So, so normally standard is 1350, and on that one it's a 1451, which is quite impressive really to pull the high gear. 